hello guys welcome to civil concept and in this video uh, i will show you the quantity of steel rod in structure okay so with the help of excel sheet how will we calculate the quantity of steel rod in a structure okay so uh, you can see here i have drawn a, a column plan in autocad so you can see this is the a column okay from here to here okay this is the ground level and uh, from ground level the footing is five feet under the ground and after this this is the uh, approximately uh, 12 or 13 feet okay so let us see we have used here 16 mm 4 rods and 12 mm 4 rods and stirrups is 8 mm okay so uh, you can see here 8 mm stirrups has been used here okay now let us see in excel sheet i have drawn a simple uh, drawing which uh, helps you to calculate the quantity of steel rod in a structure or column okay let's say it as a column so uh, structure uh, column i have written here uh, structure because you can also calculate the quantity of steel rod in a beam footing etc uh, in the same process uh, in any structure uh, in, in any member okay so quantity of steel rod in a column for now okay so you can see here the detail of this column are given here so we have used 16 mm 4 piece and uh, the length of one rod is how much 20 feet and uh, 12 mm of rod to uh, four piece which is 20 feet okay and 8 mm of stirrups uh, which ha which are 40 feet okay 40 quantity of stirrups used and uh, its each length is 4 feet okay and this is 12 by 12 column this is only for example uh, and uh, its quantity uh, and uh, its length may be different but uh, the calculation process is same okay so this is only for example you can use this tool this excel sheet to calculate the quantity of steel rod in uh, column beam footing uh, slab etc in the same process okay guys so let's start our video and uh, the download link of this excel sheet i will put in the description you can download from there okay so let's start first of all i have uh, 16 mm of 4 piece 20 feet okay so i will select here 16 feet okay so diameter of the sorry 16 mm diameter of the steel bars is 16 mm okay and length of bar is how much here is given 20 feet okay so 20 feet first of all uh, we have to convert it in meter because you have to put the length of a steel rod in meter but here is feet so 20 feet is equal to how much we will use here convert feet to meter this tool and uh, we will put here how much 20 feet okay 20 feet and convert you can get 6.1 meter okay so i am putting here 6.1 meter and quantity of bar how much how many bars we have used we have used how much four piece okay so four number of bars we have used okay put here four now again see 12 number of bars okay so i will select here 12 okay and uh, length of bar is how much 20 feet is also 20 feet so it will also be 6.1 meter and uh, there are also four piece so put here four now we have eight mm of the steel bar so we, we will uh, select here eight okay so eight and now we have 40 piece of stirrups and length is 4 feet again we have to convert it into meter so put here first of all 4 feet and convert you will get 1.22 uh, 1.22 1.22 meter okay now there are 20, uh, total 40 piece of the stirrups so put here 40 piece and uh, boom guys so when you calculate it we will get how much total steel rod required for this column will be 79.43 guys this is the estimation of this column and uh, you can do the estimation of different uh, section like beam column slab in the same way okay you can calculate the estimation of the steel rod for uh, in the same process and you can see here quantity of steel one it means this 16 mm rod will be 38.51 it is the individual calculation of the steel rod and uh, if we can uh, add all these three then total we will get how much 79.43 kg and steel 2 it means 12 mm rod will be how much 21.66 kg and stirrups which is 8 mm will be how much 19.3 kg okay guys? so summary uh, after adding all these uh, steel rod we will get how much 79. 
43 kg okay guys so in this way we can calculate the quantity of steroid in a column and uh, please guys if you like this video then please like this video and subscribe my channel for new update about civil engine thank you